Hey everyone, welcome back. Today is Friday. It's the end of a long week and I am ready to enjoy this weekend. But first, I want to talk to you guys um, about something that's near and dear to me. I want to talk about the weaponizing of LinkedIn. So I myself have had people try and get me fired because of some of the things that I say in these videos. They've called my HR department by looking me up through LinkedIn and they've reported me. And even though, you know, HR couldn't do anything, it's still the fact that people have tried. So I wanna to talk to you guys about maybe modifying or deleting the latest entry in your LinkedIn profile so that it doesn't show where you currently work. Um, a lot of you guys are very strong-willed people and opinionated people will post things like maybe let's say even your political opinion online or let's say you piss off somebody who used to be your girlfriend or something whatever all I'm saying to you guys is that if somebody finds your name online they can look you up through LinkedIn and they can and they will use it against you so here's your warning uh, modify your LinkedIn profiles to delete your latest entry and your title and modify it. Uh, come up with something superficial like uh, your talent scout or whatever. doesn't matter um, because your LinkedIn isn't necessarily your resume. But don't wait until it's too late. If you express your opinions online, somebody's going to disagree with you and there's a lot of weirdos out there and these weirdos will use it against you and try and get you fired like it's some game and it, it's really disgusting that people would stoop to that level because like I'm supporting a family of five people and you know they depend on me and if I didn't have my job true I could probably find another job but that doesn't matter this is my career man and people are trying to get me fired because i I said to a doctor that I don't want to leave a piece of equipment in the in the operating room that had propofol up inside it and it was an electrical hazard. I actually had people try and get me fired because of the video I made telling the story of that situation that happened earlier that day. I don't know why somebody would try and get me fired, but whatever. Change your LinkedIn profiles don't indicate where you currently work. It seems to be a growing trend that people are looking you up and they're contacting your HR department because of your political views or whatever and they're trying to get you fired. So change your profile. It doesn't need to show your current status unless you're actively looking for a job. And then after you get a job, change your status. You don't have to show like where you currently work. I know that's kind of how LinkedIn was designed but people are using it against you. So that's the only warning you're gonna get. Modify those profiles, guys, especially if you're a strong-willed person. If you're conservative-leaning, I strongly recommend changing that profile. Somebody's gonna use it against you. Me, I don't even argue politics online, uh, especially anymore, because you're not gonna change anybody's opinion. But if you choose to do so, why not? Go ahead, but just reminder, that if you are wearing a shirt with your company logo or something, somebody can and eventually will try and get you fired. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good weekend.